This is Negative Keyword Pro. And what this does is taps into what people are searching for when they go to a search engine. So it uses predictive search technology. So for example, when someone starts to type electrician, okay, what are the next common searches that come up? If you're on a search engine searching, it'll usually show you five to 10 results. Um, but with negative keyword pro, we are going to see hundreds of these. So let's take a look at how this works. I'm just gonna click get suggestions. And here we see 540 results. Now all I need to do is go through this list and look at which ones uh, don't make sense and keywords that I don't wanna pay for. So if I'm running an electrician business, I don't wanna pay for people searching for salaries or jobs or schools and you can see there are a lot of locations in here uh, that's because the tool is location based I don't want to pay for apprentice tools classes certification okay, and I'm gonna go down this list and it might take a while but every time I check one of these boxes I'm going to be saving money on a future click that me or one of my clients would have had to pay Google for. Now, once I've checked all the boxes I want to, you can see a list has shown up here. If I want, I can go ahead and remove something okay, pretty easily. And once I have the list I want, I just copy all. It's going to pop up here for me to copy and paste. And that's it. Now, if I want to do the same thing with uh, Amazon, let's say, then I would just change this to Amazon and this will give me all this predictive results that show up on Amazon. And you can see, of course, these are a lot more uh, e-commerce related results. And I could do the same thing with YouTube. So very powerful tool. If, uh, you know, depending on what you're spending, this is going to save you hundreds or thousands of dollars on uh, your campaigns. It's gonna save you from having to sort through a bunch of irrelevant search terms, things that should have been excluded in the first place. You're going to go right to the source. What are people actually searching for? and exclude these things from your campaigns from the start.